real treat for you today. We're going to make a Mediterranean feast with an Italian flair. We have some beautiful sea bass, so we're going to cook them whole with some fresh herbs from the garden. We're going to make a tomato salad, some cannellini beans, lots of beautiful olive oil, some vegetables. I think it's going to be a really beautiful evening, so please come join us. Cheers. Mr. Fish. He's a big boy, isn't he? When you order fish from the supermarket whole, get them to remove the scales and remove the guts. Dealing with a whole fish is never pretty, but they do have beautiful flavor. Here we are stuffing them with some rosemary sprigs that we snipped from the garden. I love growing my own herbs. Now they're ready for the oven. I made an olive oil dipping sauce by mincing up a clove of garlic, adding some Italian herbs and some salt and pepper. I just stirred it up and I used a spoonful of this to put inside each fish and then I put the rest on a plate so that we could use it as a dipping sauce for bread. Oh, I love when it's tomato season. Look at these beautiful heirloom tomatoes. I just love tomatoes. They're so good for you. We're going to make a tomato salad out of this one. Look how juicy it is when you're slicing it up. Wow, look at that. I took another tomato and chopped it up and added some salt, pepper, garlic, onions, and oregano, and a good helping of olive oil. Stir it all together, and we're going to use this one as a topping for bruschetta. I'm spreading out a little regatta cheese onto this Italian baguette. And then I'm topping each one with a spoonful of the bruschetta. Such wonderful flavor. I added some balsamic vinegar to some extra virgin olive oil. I'm stirring that up and I'm going to pour this all over our tomato salad with some cucumber and some red onion. Here's our dipping sauce. And here is our beautiful Mediterranean feast. We prepared these cannellini beans with a little bit of leafy greens and some red pepper, tomato cucumber red onion salad, tomato bruschetta, a beautiful Italian baguette, some Kalamata olives with some spinach, olive oil dipping sauce, and a sparkling wine. Here's our fish out of the oven. I told you it's not a pretty sight. <laughs> but they have beautiful flavor. Here it is filleted. So flaky. Tender. 
I like making a whole fish because you have to take your time eating it so you don't get any bones. So we took a little bit of each and put it on our plate. Thank you for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed our Mediterranean feast. I just love the Mediterranean diet, don't you? It's just full of so many wonderful flavors. Please share this video with your friends. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a thumbs up. Tell all your friends and I will see you next time. Cheers. Mm.